Okay, part two of my past on VCR a PVA 661 being dead. So another thing I have to address is I could have done this. I could have like taken the heads off of my RCA VR 622 HF I got in November 2017 that that cartoon classics tape got stuck in there when I tracked and I pushed it back in after it. I made it eat it for no reason, but by by um pull, holding up the tape kind of like this, I would not wind it back in. But but I could have taken the head drum off of that one and put it put it on this one. It might have fixed the problem, but maybe maybe it wouldn't. But but it was in the basement at the time because it was four months after my after the closet and the carpet got installed in September 2019. All my VCRs went down except for all these that are up here right now. I could have done that, but I realized why. I'll show you guys why that tape is stuck in there. I'll show you guys right now. I'll zoom the camera in. Stop, I'm screenshotting, but I'll zoom the camera in. See that? Those are timing marks right there. And what happened was that gear that white gear, it went all the way forward, causing the VCR to get, to get, to get jammed. Of course, I could turn the, the worm gear right there, as you can see, and turn it back, and the guides there would fret around the head drum. If I turn on, it would fret, but... The tape one eject, it was just stuck. Cause that was all the way for it was not like that. That's it's home rest home position. And that's probably what happened when I when it ejected. It probably skipped all the way forward and uh, yeah, I heard a loud snap and I knew something went wrong and I took the top off and the tape was like hanging there, but I cut it and it thought it would get it out, but I could not get the frickin' tape out. I could not. It was... It was jammed, and these screws were being blocked. Because the tape was stuck. Only this, and this bracket, and this could come out, and, it, and the chassis would lift out with these screws, but it would not lift out. So that's part two. It's pretty short, but I've had this VCR for a pretty long time. It had a good life. It was a good machine. Love the quality on it. Probably the ones with the VHS HQ probably makes it look even better. But yeah, rest in peace. This VCR, nineteen ninety-eight to to two thousand twenty January. Hope you enjoyed this video. And one day I will find another VCR like this down the road. I promise you, I will try to. And obviously, I will get rid of every broken VCR I have in the house. Including this one, of course. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.